It's your girl, Mickey, 360 Radio, Connected Radio, the Ye area. It's a beautiful Yay. Monday night. Ye-ye. Yes, that's Ye-ye. right. Uh, area. Remy Thiz is in the building. Um, I need to, uh, he's right next to me, so we'll get him in the shot here shortly. Um, but he brought his family member in, so let's introduce who you are and where you're from. To my left. What's happening, y'all? It's your boy, Royal RDMR. So that, what does that stand for? Yes, it means respectfully doing me regardless respectfully of what anybody thinks. Me regardless. regardless. Yeah. And where are you from? Pittsburgh, California, west to be exact. Oh, nice. Okay. So how long have you been doing this music game? Man, I've been doing music about 15 years. Okay. Yeah, a little longer back in, in school earlier, but okay. yeah, really serious, like 15 for surely. Obviously, a big influence on my right is Remy. Um, who who else would you say influenced you musically? Man, other than Remy Thiz, my boy T1, he produces for me, good friend of mine. Uh, my partner, Detail, he's from the 707 okay. from Fairfield, Detail, and uh, Razor Sharp. That's oh, my brother. I, I know Remy I know brother, about him. Man. Yes. Um Remy taught me about him. So I need to get him in the building too at some point. Oh, for surely. Um yeah. we'll definitely get Razor Ooh. Sharp in the building. So just have him hit me up. Um as far as tonight we're here to promote. Are you do you have new music available? What are you here to push tonight? Uh here to push an album that's coming up we're gonna release. But right now, I got out a few songs from the album. Okay. Um, and then just to give you guys a heads up, this uh, big little jar, and I said the L word, but it's because I'm describing it. So this is the jar where if you describe anything you're doing as as the L word, you get taxed. So most of the money in that jar is mine. I say it a lot. that I, I fuck up and say it a lot. So anything you do should not be L. It should be big, uh, even if it's a... Even if it's something in your career that you feel is not as large as other things, everything you do, if it's a project, if you've dropped anything, that is a large accomplishment. You should always say everything is big. Everything you're doing is really big. So that's what that jar is to. I agree. I agree. We dream big. To get big. across. Yes. Um, yes. We're, uh, so Remy brought, um, I actually met Royal through him. So you came up and you did a um, a show with Lisa at the uh, Menifee Art Space. So you came and did an all things indie show. Um, I remember that was the night I met you actually. Yeah. Correct. So um, as far as that, do you have any other live performances you have going on right now? Anything to promote while you're here other than the music? Uh, no, no live performances. We had something in um, in Vegas not too long ago. But uh, that got stopped early, Uh-oh. so Nuh-uh. we just stayed out here, shot some more videos. I got some videos coming. Okay. Yeah. Nice. I got some performances I got lined up for you. Just give me some time, man. I'm putting them in the work. Yeah, we working on that. Okay. And I heard the man. So Remy Thiz. Remy is um, a man of all trades, really. So he um, is the guy who is c- connecting artists to promoters. He's the guy who is putting artists on the stage. He's the guy who is connecting artists to podcasts, connecting, connecting, connecting. So everybody needs to follow Remy Thiz, R-E-M-Y-T-I-T-H-I-Z-Z. That would be how you catch this guy. So um, and before the end of the night, we'll get some pictures in with him and all of that. So but how how as far as like family, you guys are blood relation? No. OK. No. How'd you no. meet him? Pittsburgh, California, P World. <laughs> we call it the P World. So yes. you know, I say it's a small world. Mm-hmm. A lot of the families are linked. You okay. Know what I mean? Yeah, that's where Jack is from. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. Jack, a uh, hustler, of the mob figures. Ryder J. Clyde. Pittsburgh with yeah. no H. Because no there's H. no hate. Yeah, I'm on that album too. <laughs> Shawnee B, my partner Shawnee B, he has a. Um, a studio called The Factory. You oh, pull okay. the cars in. And, nice. Yeah. That's great to know. But he put out an album called Pittsburgh No H. Yeah. And I'm on there. So that's... that was one of the first projects I was featured on, too. So that's big. Thank you, Shiny B. Okay, yes. Uh, that's always nice to, to credit the people that gave us the shots in the beginning. I know that for a fact. Is this an old yeah, press-up? Yeah. Is that what King Frico? Yeah, yeah, for sure. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. 
Rest in peace. Look at Freak that. Out. That's a hard copy CD right there. That's what we call a CD, kids. <laughs> <laughs> it's a compact yeah. disc. Yeah. yeah. You open many, it. Many moons ago. You open it up and then you place this cylinder circle thing. Man. Some people used to ride on them like this. Yeah, you were so happy doing it too. Right. Uh, to open it, man, it was like Christmas. It mm -hmm. was. And then you would slide the circular thing into the machine and then it would read it and it would play it. it so would play music. And we would burn mm -hmm. a lot of those too. Burn and <laughs> yeah. CDs was, mix. was yeah. super um mm -hmm. I used lime wire, all this all this shit, all this stuff. So um what's the first song you're gonna go into? Running it up. Run it up. What so we always try and do. Let's um, talk about got that. Got a big feature on there. Big What's feature. some background on it? Who did your beat? Uh, Detail. Detail did the beat. He mixed it. You know, um, Static Major, uh, the guy who uh, does a lot of hooks for E40. Oh, okay. Yeah, he did the Ooh. hook on this. Yeah, yeah okay. for surely Bay Area. Yeah, I love 40. So it's, it's real homegrown. He from the 707. Okay. Static is. So yeah. that'll be dope to hear. Um, so we're going into this Royal uh, RDMR. We're going to have Remy go in and give him the third song while you we're playing this one. So let's go ahead and run that in, DJ Eddie Z. It's your girl, Mickey 360 Radio Connected. Featuring Fabulous. Hey. Mr. Fab. That is a big feature. The Freestyle King. You feel me? The Fabulous Mr. Fab. Hey. I rap and got fans, that's how I got fans. Play with me, fan man, you can catch these hands. Telling you in advance, trying to give you a chance. You can walk out of here, leave in the ambulance. My steppers bring the pepper, my steppers, they don't dance. They step on shit like crushing so they can. Ruining your plans, best listen to your man. So we drumming on your head like we beating pots and pans. With our hands and feet, let me catch you in the street. If we catch you in the club, we gon' stop you to the beat. Put you on your seat, tell you to repeat. What you said, go ahead, read out loud your tweet. If you slipping in, we tripping, that's for sure. Got my hitters with me, you know they don't go. And I ain't gotta put no money on your fro. Stay on your tippy toes, hand on the floor. If you slipping in, we tripping, that's for sure. Got my hitters with me, you know they don't go. And I ain't gotta put no money on your fro. Stay on your tippy toes. out your teeth, make it hard for you to speak. You said you wanted beef, now it's hard for you to eat. You said you wanted smoke, so I brought it for the meat. And I keep that fire on me, I be raising up the heat. Say the most, do the least. All that talking is cheap, like the no least see. Stalking up the wrong tree, thinking that it's sweet. Pop the floor, would you like somebody spill the drink? Stay on your tippy toes, hand on the floor. If you slipping, then we tripping, that's for sure. Got my hitters with me, you know they don't go. And I ain't gotta put no money on your fro. Stay on your tippy toes, hand on the floor. If you slipping, then we tripping, that's for sure. Got my hitters with me, you know they don't go. And I ain't gotta put no money on your fro. Stay on your tippy toes. Stay on your tippy toes. Stay on your tippy toes. Oh, you can play a third song. Stay on your tippy toes. Huh? Oh, he does. You, you gotta send him the third song. It's your girl, Mickey. 360 Radio. Yeah. Oh, that was Tiptoe. That wasn't Run It Up. That was Tiptoe. Tip so that was featuring Ice Mees. Yeah. And you. Yeah. Super dope. We just had Mees in here recently. Yeah, Mees is on the remix. Yeah. Super, super so dope. We're going to drop that first. So. He's a dope artist. Um, got a lot of respect for him. He's been pushing a hard line. So. Yeah. yeah. Ice Mees from mm -hmm. Fairfield. I just feel like he's a very nice, like, kind of just like he's got a good um ethic honor system like he's just very uh he has a good name in this well, business well, well, I like to call a solid, dude. solid solid not salad right. that part <laughs> that part i i am also solid not salad um so yeah that was that was definitely dope is that's yeah. to come that's that's not released yet no, that's Tip not toe? released. That's the yeah, next that's, release. Yeah, that's a bla that's a blap. Yeah, we got a video for it and everything. Can't you see that being played like in the skating rink and at the uh, mm -hmm. car shows and mm -hmm. in the having club? Fun. Yeah, yeah. Wait till you yeah, see the video. The video is having fun. Have fun. Yeah. Well, who's who's over here to your left? Let's introduce uh, this your is my friend. producer partner. It's T One from T1 San on Francisco. T One on the beat. T One on the beat. T One, San Francisco in the building. Much love. Let's go. Yep, and how? Yep, yeah, yep. they can they can hear you on this mic, Remy. Um, that's why I want to get you in. Closer. I'm just loud. I know they hear me. <laughs> <laughs> you can you can inch in here by Mick Yizzle so that they can see your face. So how did you meet uh, T1? Uh, he was my neighbor. He moved in. Well, I moved in next door to him. There you go. You know, and he's yeah. standoffish. I'm standoffish. I don't bother nobody. You know what I mean? <laughs> so y'all are the same. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 
that I kept yeah. hearing music like bumping on the wall because our, our walls were adjacent, our home. So I'm hearing that bump and I'm like, what is that? He, I'm thinking he's coming in from work, sleep, or in, in his car playing music because right. I do that. Right. You know, Slapping. so I'm thinking he bumping. Yeah. Yeah. Then when I uh, finally talked to him one day, he tell me, oh, no, I'm not in my car. I'm, I'm upstairs. I got the studio. Oh, he's making beats. Yeah, he's yeah. making beats. <laughs> so that's like a match there. made in yeah, heaven, too. Instant, instant T1, like, oh, how yeah. long you been doing that? How long you been making Man, beats? I've been making beats since I was probably 17 years old. So a little over 20 years, 25 years. Same as me then. Yeah, yeah, yep. yep, yep. Welcome to the dollhouse yeah, here. You, so um, San Francisco, so it's a lot of your uh, major influences as far as beats and production is probably like RBL and RBL, Coog and Andre Nicotina Coog. Yep. All the, Peace, Coog. all the good ones. Yeah. This is one of the tattoos I've got right here. This is a San Francisco tat right there for 211. Um, so okay. that was one of my favorites. And then this one too is San Francisco. <laughs> So that's for RBL. Many, hey, many people don't know about 211. Oh, I, I'm, yeah, Draws is a good friend of mine. Yeah, so. that's, I grew up with too. Yeah, super yeah, that's dope. That's a real good friend of mine. Super yeah. dope. He's, he's mm -hmm. like uh, my real connection on the, um, let's talk about exclusives. When Draws sends you exclusives, like that could be an RBL exclusive. You oh, just yeah. never oh, know. Yeah. You know, mm -hmm. so it's really nice to have him mm -hmm. in the wheelhouse. So shout out to Big Draws. I love you so much. Um, it's always nice to have friends in high places like this guy. You know, I just talked to Cooley, the underdog on the phone as we were coming in. Um, we're going to book him for either next Monday or the Monday after. And I want to say happy birthday to the cut. Happy who, birthday, Cooley. It's actually his birthday today. Tomorrow. Tomorrow. I thought it was today. Tomorrow. So happy birthday to Coolio, the underdog, unknown legend. Um, he was just recently on stage with La Russell at the Pergola. So that was super dope to see. So was that planned, Remy, do you know, or did he just jump up on there? Well, actually what it was was it was, we was in Martinez. And it was a, a dispensary. They uh, had a private party for their employees. Mm -hmm. So they brought La Russell and uh, Coolio in, and they just kind of, instead of doing their own sets, he just did his set and he told Coolio just to join in. So after he did his first verse, you know what I'm saying? I don't know if you see the video, you see he said, get you some. Mm -hmm. Get you some. Yeah, I did. Get Show. you some. Yeah. Kind of like get on it and let's see what your freestyle is like, you boy, know? And if anybody knows the underdog, oh, he got that it. boy freestyles go crazy. Absolutely. Night, okay? Night, Man, he ripped it. Yeah, he, he did. And he always does because that's just what he does. Shout that's out to the does. live feed. Louis Lope is tuned in, 415. Talk about the city. There's a city right there. Louis Lope. Uh -huh. Uh, Tiger Hood tuned in. I see you, Tiger. Bread 209 all the way from Stockton. He's tuned in. Yes, thank you. What up, Louie? We're, we need you in here. Uh, C. Dell is on the on the live as well. So uh, we're just in here bumping some dope music from Royal. So um, what oh are boy. some what are some good uh, tips of advice for up and coming artists if uh, if if they need some motivation or uh, good words? Consistency. Believe in yourself. <laughs> For surely motivate yourself, mm -hmm. you quality. know, because what you say? Quality, quality for surely, mm -hmm. you know. And um, if you love it, keep doing it. Go for it for real. Invest in yourself. Right. Put your money where your mouth is. Definitely. And I think the um the confidence is key you know uh a lot of people don't know that you don't know like if it's your first time on stage no one knows that so if you're like strong enough to get out there and rock that shit and make it look like it's not brand new they're not gonna know it's not brand new. right so that's kind of i feel the same way about that you can stumble over some words exactly and they don't know that that you might be part of that. the yeah the rap right you, you just never know rock. Um, and as far as like, where do you go to uh, watch? Do, what's some of your favorite podcasts? I like to get people to shout them out. Man, 360 oh, radio thank you. for sure. I appreciate that. Love this podcast. Thank you. Um, that was unsolicited, by the way. I didn't yeah, pay him for that. I don't really watch too many. Okay. I really don't. I just be on scrolling and you see those podcasts, but I never really know the name. I don't follow right. any closely. Other than 360 Radio. Oh, nice. So. Well, I appreciate that. That's super, uh, super big love. So it's a good thing you're in the building then today. Yay. Uh, we got um, some more people on the live. We got Burner the Boy. Uh, Breezy Burner is Michelle. on. Yep. So uh, definitely nice to have. This is a division of San Francisco, Pittsburgh, and 
The Bay Area. The Bay, Bay Area. Bay. I'm all over, man. He's got Pittsburgh, all Pittsburgh, kinds Pittsburgh. of spots, right? <laughs> like a leopard. Well, shout out to my B Town family, you know what I'm saying? Oakland, California, you know what I mean? Hey, the Crest, they know what it is, man. They know me anywhere. Absolutely. Much love to Remy, always hooks it <laughs> up. So, what's your next song? So, we did Tiptoe, and that was the uh, Mies is on the remix, but we're going to do the. Run it up with the Mr. Fab, right? Yes. Let's so that do would that. be next. Okay, so Slapper. that's Run Slapper. It Up featuring yeah. Fabby Davis. This is Royal in the Slapper. building. Exclusive, y'all. exclusive. Ex- exclusive. When an impromptu sideshow took over an intersection in a residential neighborhood. This was over the weekend. And a neighbor took video of the event, which took place yesterday around 5 p.m. This was on Carl Street at 7th Avenue. Back to back, back to back, back. ten and trucks. Let them hate, we don't give a fuck. fuck. Get into it, this ain't love. Over here, running it up. Back to back, back. ten and trucks. Let them hate, we don't give a fuck. Get into it, this ain't love. Over here, running it up. It's boiling it up. I ain't got a lot to kick it. I was talking about a bag when I asked for the digit. You could be a midget, I hit it till you pigeon toe. You ain't got no dough, you gotta go. Shorty hit the road. Bye bye. See how I be fucking with it, pulling up in Benzes, AMG Kitty, wonder how I did it, my own business, if I tell you then I gotta kill you like I do the kitten, no serious, no kidding, money I be getting, money I be spending, that's a write off, good riddance, on the go, no sitting, down unless I'm shitting, still touching paper, deliver like I'm in labor, wave to the haters like hot to my neighbors, saw me coming up, they wouldn't hold the elevator, I knew I'd see them later, I had to take the stairs, in these red bottoms, I need me another pair, back to back. Ten and trucks, let them hate, we don't give a fuck. Get into it, this ain't love. Over here, running it up. Back to back, ten and trucks, let them hate, we don't give a fuck. Get into it, this ain't love. Over here, running it up, running it up. That was blapping, 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 blapping. Static Major, you can kind of hear that's the same voice you, it's a very um, recognizable hook right there because he does so many hooks, so yeah. kind of legendary to have that. Yes, he is, man. He heard that song. Detail, who produced the beat, is from Vallejo, so he reached out to Static. Mm, nice. Yeah. Isn't that nice when your music does the work for you? Yeah. You don't even have to make the moves. And at first he was like, uh, oh, bro, I need a certain amount more than what we was offering it. But he hadn't listened to it yet. Right. He heard it. He hit us back. Hey, it's good. I got you. For right that. in your wheelhouse. Right. Yeah. Yep. Let's do it. Um, let me shout out to this is the the beer that was given to me when I was at the Oak Park Brewery. This is the beer dedicated to Shock G, his legacy from Digital Underground. So we do like to showcase this here. You can oh, yeah, purchase these. Shock G. You can purchase these at Oak Park Brewery if you want to yeah, promote imagine. or support the the movement. Um, we also have um, another guest coming in after Royal, so make sure you guys keep your ears to the speakers. And we have some pretty dope people coming up for the next um, couple of weeks. You know, we're actually interviewing um, First Degree, the DEs, like one of the big um, Brother Lynch hung, you oh, know, yeah. garden block days. Like yeah, that. I love him. That's why I rap, Sebo. Oh, you don't see. I heard Sebo one time with my partner, Rob Bass from Pittsburgh. Oh, okay. He always had the Walkman on, the earphones in his ears, the big ones. Yes, yes. It's before the beats, but he always. And uh, I seen him one time and he put it on my head, and I heard Bo, that gas chamber, Mm. and the, the music and the. The detail that he wrapped in, it's like he took you on a trip with him. Yes. Or you could see it. I was in love with Oh, yeah. Just real. the even the beginning of the song. And then it takes you into the, uh, I'm trying to drop the gas from the chamber. And it's like, oh, my That's God. No, ain't it hard? That shit was, and I was living in Reading at the time. My dad was a city official in the city of Reading, which is like two hours north of here. Super square bear dot com. Right. And I'm rolling around playing gas chamber by SIBO. Mm. It hadn't. I had no place there. All right. <laughs> I, I was like, as soon as I graduated, I hit Sacramento. I was not staying in Reading for sure, <laughs> especially with a father as a city official. That was not oh, the wow. business Whoa. at all. Um, how do they find you? What's your YouTubes? What are all your social sites? Uh, yeah, all my handles Royal R D M R. So that's R-O-Y-A-L-R-D-M-R, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, 
everything. So you're kind of in the genre of use, utilizing both hard copy CD like we see here on yeah, your, uh, with you yeah. and streaming. So uh, and as, as far as like utilizing the Internet to promote versus hand to hand promotion, you've probably seen both. Do you feel like it has improved? Do you feel like the Internet improved the situation or do you feel like it was better when it was hand to hand contact or is it a little bit of both? I said the L word. I got a dollar on that. Sorry. It's some of both. Hey, draws. Mm -hmm. We you got to do it you. all. It just gave, it gave it more work, but you get more out of the work. Mm -hmm. Now with the with true the with the with the hand to hand. Like I think hand to hand probably was more effective because you got to meet people face to face, but you didn't get to cover as much ground as you can on the internet. So I think it's a it's kind of a mixture of both. Um, it was, I think that it was better in the old days, but that's what all of us old heads say, right? And I think it's good in the new as well. But so. they were making more money, too, True. off the tape. Right, and know, we were just copy. talking about that because we, we even have discussed, like, RBL, has, they made, like, a quarter of a meal out the trunk, yeah, you know? Black C. Back in the 90s yeah. when it was unheard of to do that kind of shit. Think, though, like they were okay. telling us last night, San Quinn, how much it costs to make a music video. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Invest yeah. money into that. You yeah. know what I'm yeah. saying? Now, it's even getting the studio. Now you can make a uh, music video with your cell phone. Yeah. Right yeah. Absolutely. Or, or have a great editor like some people do. Right. You can you can make your music video with your cell phone. You can make your track with your cell phone. You can make your beat with your cell phone. You can um, pretty much like I I've met a lot of people the younger generation of kids and this is not to you know say that this is wrong but they don't know any other way, you know, like than the phone. Like that's right. that's the only way they know. They've never seen a CD player per se, or they've never even cassette tapes are way like they don't. That shit is like an eight track to them, you know. Oh, like yeah, yeah, yeah. For they real, for real. I'm like, we really used to play tapes in our car. Like I used to play a tape. I would. I remember because one of them got stuck in my car at full blast, and it was Brother Lynch hung um, season of the sick. Oh, yeah. So that whole album, like, oh, man, slap, that front to back. Boy, stuff the little hole just so I could put it in the recorder and record over the Absolutely. Yeah. That's how you would dub a tape is you had to, you had to, yeah, it was some fucking, who knew, who even taught us how to do that take, shit? Take, take music off the radio. Who yeah. taught us how to do that? And, and if, if the tape tore, you could repair it with a piece of cool Absolutely. Tape. So was, <laughs> and if you wanted to make a dope intro for your voicemail, you just you had to record when the song was on. You didn't have right. a choice of like catching the right <laughs> spot. You got to make sure you catch that shit and go fast with it. Yeah. Okay, hey, I see you, Velbecha, tuned in. Switch Rich, I see you tuned in. Mar Marzi. Tuned radio. in, draws tuned in, D snaps, yeah, Joe A. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got some nice uh, listeners. Really so this is the third track. So let's talk about that track before we go into it. What did you just give the DJ? We can. Um, what's it called, Eddie? What's it called, T one? Run it up. Oh, this is the yeah, run it up run track. It up. So th bad. we didn't get to the run it up track yet. No, we oh. the track that we played the last time we just had his verse on. Oh, yeah. okay. So we have the full one product. now. Yep. Got it. Okay. What's up, Ray's? I see you tuned in on Ray's. Ray's sharp. sharp. The sharpest. Get your ass in here. Hit me up for a date. DJ Eddie Z on the wheels, y'all. Yeah. Tough. Was over an intersection in a residential neighborhood. This was over the weekend. And a neighbor took video of the event, which took place yesterday around 5 p.m. This was on Carlton Street and Chapter Street at 7th Avenue. This beat has been detailed. Back to back, to back. to the truck. Let them hate. We don't give a fuck. Get into it. This ain't love. What's cracking in LA? I'm like, what's cracking? I got the line on the package. We out of state and we taxing. I'm going hard on them kids, Joe Jackson. Crazy on the beat, I especially love it when it's slapping. When you catch me in the streets, I be like, what's up, man? What's happening? Keep a wine on me, gotta be prepared for street magic. When you catch me in my old school, baby, it's a classic. Looking, I can't let them haters get near on me. I'm the man in my state and that's clear on me. Baby, wanna suck me? Gonna put them veneers on me. And if you hating on the boy, then you weird, homie. Back to back, back to back. 
ride. Ten and try. Let them hate. We don't give a fuck. Get into it. This ain't luck. Over here, running it up. Back to back. Ten and try. Let them hate. We don't give a fuck. Get into it. This ain't luck. Over here, running it up. It's royal. I ain't got a lot of kick it. I was talking about a bag when I asked for the digits. You could be a midget. I'll hit it till you pigeon toe. You ain't got no dough. You gotta go. Shorty hit the road. Bye bye. See how I be fucking with it, pulling up in Benzes, AMG Kitty, wonder how I did it, my own business, if I tell you then I gotta kill you like I do the kitten, no serious, no kidding, money I be getting, money I be spending, that's a write off, good riddance, on the go, no sitting, down unless I'm shitting, still touching paper, deliver like I'm in labor, wave to the haters like hot to my neighbors, saw me coming up, they wouldn't hold the elevators, I knew I'd see them later, I had to take the stairs, in these red bottoms, I need me another pair, back to back. Ten and try, let them hate, we don't give a fuck. Get into it, this ain't luck. Over here, running it up. Back to back, ten and try, let them hate, we don't give a fuck. Get into it, this ain't luck. Over here, running it up, running it up. Hey, run that up when we drop that too. Yeah, that's dope. That's a slap. Come <laughs> see. People on the uh, live feed saying slap, putting up the hand, slap, <laughs> slap. <laughs> so super dope. Uh, make sure you guys uh, follow. What's T1? What's your handle? Well, my handle is Therapeutic Music LLC, and that's on Instagram. Okay. Yep. And um, Royal, we got yours, but say it again for the Yeah, people. Royal RDMR at Gmail everywhere. You feel me? That's the email. Pay me. Let's and, do a verse. And you said the RDMR stands for respectfully respect doing, doing me, me regardless. regardless. Respectfully doing me regardless. I mean, it's mm, definitely like MCEism for sure. Um, Remy, uh, what's what's your call handle? What's how do they get hold of you? At Remy Thiz, or you can email me Remy Thiz is fifty at gmail dot com on Facebook. Remy Thiz Westbrook. Man, holler at me, man. We gonna put something together. Oh yeah, I know. Uh, Mackish is from the P two. 